Hello and welcome back to Civilization 5 as America. In case you missed out on the last one, lots of stuff happened actually. Still pretty bad demographics wise. What really, really um, threw everything for Ringer is that every single com uh, country in the world declared war on us. Just out of the blue, we were friendly with Ethiopia. At one point we were friendly with Germany and all of a sudden they started hating us again. Everyone thinks that we're warmongers, even though we've never declared a war. And, um, yeah, every single city-state is at war, war with us, too. So, this game has just been completely whack. Let's see if we can pull it off, though. If I can take Moscow, some miraculous kind of events, then everything will be groovy. New York is holding out for dear life. You in here give you a little bit more events. I don't even have enough. I'm, I'm oh yeah, and I'm losing tons of money, and I'm unhappy. <laughs> Trifecta of awesome. Man, those crossbowmen—they're just like seriously, just like little spitwads. In Moscow. Moscow has. If you're you're wondering, Moscow has the. Red Fort, which makes their defensive bonus, their defensive um, buildings that like 25% stronger. So that means that they're pretty much impenetrable. Plus, they got the Great Wall, which is part of the reason why this war has taken so freaking long. We had to march all through out here, slowly, 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 which is why we have these little tiny footprints. In the sand, yeah, uh, break into their territory. Okay, so right here, I have to decide between with this cannon and musketman. What do I want to do with that? Do I, I think what I need to do is move him? That's my best bet. Can I hit you from there? Yes, I can. Fiddle him down a little bit. See if I can hurt him some more. You need to get out of here because you're hurt. Like no other. Maybe he's all holding the fort down in the front. Okay. China denounce. Blah. New York is captured by Braslava. And they're probably raising it. Yep. Very really well, New York. It's been fun. We're gonna run out of money here real short. We can't do any trade routes because everyone hates us. It goes one of my cannons. I need to get up another cannon. Is oh my gosh. Okay. Can't. Okay, we need to get this crossbowman over here. Pronto. Pronto. I mean, he's got to get over here. Um, worry mostly about melee units. Melee boats. Um, yeah. Take him out. Back some more. Oh gosh darn it, I missed the stupid promotion. Can't afford to miss out on any kind of attack power whatsoever in this case. Or in at this point in the game. You are gonna move up here. Keep you here to prevent anyone from coming out or to try to Keep them distracted.
Bum, bum, bum. Hmm. Interesting. That is a lot of firepower. We can get this. Can get the crossbowman in there. I think we will be able to survive. That's a big if, though. Okay, we are gonna go with fortified units and cities. Um, city, 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 and city, city. We have to hold out as long as possible. Like two more turns, I think. Maybe three. Which is actually asking a lot, but I don't really have a choice at this point. I have to take Moscow if I'm gonna be able to do anything in this game. I that's the best bet. I'm trying to get them down as much as possible. Oh gosh. So the fact they have Gatling guns out is pretty good for them. Um, if I had any kind of money whatsoever, those guys would already be upgraded. Okay, so we got you in here. We're gonna do our best to try to survive this. So close, we're in the red! Oh my gosh! Can we do it? Can we do it? Heal up. Um, we can't afford to... Go into Heroic Epic at this point. Because we just... That was it. Need the castle in there. Maybe I can distract him with a little bit of this. I had a worker out there to kind of get them away from attacking. Ouchy mama. And I'm in the negative money, so that's awesome. I wonder if what that does exactly. Um. Maybe hurt my military units? I know it hurts the science a lot. 21, ouch. A huge, huge hit to my science. Okay. Cannot take it yet. You, my friend. Heal, heal. Okay, so we got... The, finally have the castle here, and I think we need to get out the Gatling gun as quickly as possible. I'm not sure how long we can hold out here, but I'm trying my best in Washington. Yeah, they're gonna be taken next turn. I feel. Unless we can call peace with them. I'll try next turn to see if I can get, to get peace. Maybe give them Belgrade or something like that. Philadelphia. Get promotion. And we can take heal every turn. Okay. You want peace, Mr. Gandhi. How about you, Mr. Bismarck? Also, raus damit. Of course not. And I keep on trying to bully you down. Maybe make Moscow our new capital. You made the great general here? No, you guys. Oh my gosh, you're killing me. You are killing me. Oh yeah, yeah. Um, I 
to move it out. I don't have any choice. That sucks. Oh, yeah, yeah. Maybe that will distract him enough to maybe last one more turn. I don't know. And let's watch our capital fall. Bum, bum, bum. Oh, and India is the lucky person to capture it. Not only are they culturally influential over us, but now apparently they own our capital. And I'm guessing that they're not going to get... People aren't going to start hating them or anything like that for the fact that they just take him our shit. More mon green stuff. Oh my gosh, so close. Come on, come on. Ah! Missed it by that much. Oh my gosh, I should have done this. Gosh darn it. Um. Yeah, we got to go up full military at this point. And this is really not going to help us at all. You know, we might have to just take over Russia, and then we'll be the new Russia, and India and Germany will be the new America. Moscow has really great defensive buildings, so if we can take Moscow, I think we will be okay to just kind of like transfer over and become kings of Canada. Alright, what can you do here? Kill you. Get the fuck out of here with him. You. Oh my gosh. Heal every turn. Take it. Yes! Can't see it, but I just fist bombed the shit out of this. Okay, MG Castle. We got 15% bonus. Great wall. Fort. Alright, create puppet. Which means we're gonna start sending our stuff down here. And see if they will peace out. What we give us. Salt. Can you give us um, Rostov? We even want Rostov. I feel like this is good for us. We'll just take the salt and get the fuck out of this stupid ass war. Yep. Okay, everyone, we have to redirect everything. We have to survive this onslaught. And somehow, this is our new capital. Um, take down the caravel. Versha, I would have been friends with you from the very beginning. But you declared war on me, and so I had to kind of take your sh stuff, so... Sorry. I don't know what else to tell you. Our money situation is still crap. But it's not as crap as it used to be. Okay, so move here. What can we hit from here? Nothing. What about from here? Start whittling down on these motherfuckers. Okay, so Sleepy Zolid can now move and heal up. Which is awesome thing to have if you had to move around from here. 
Next you there. I don't think he'll get killed. Actually, I'm not going to risk it. Military units at this point are just too... too important. For you, my friend, we are going to move over here. The marching across, we might be able to defend... Shalza. We just might be able to get through this, especially with the Red Fort being able to buff defense in our cities. And once we get to artillery, then we can start, then we can take back Washington, take it, take Essen and Boston, I think. We might have to go just full domination this game. Um, in order to survive. I mean, in order to win, at least. Not that we have to win. It's mostly just kind of a... punish game. Definitely interesting, that's for sure. Move you up here, move you up here. What can you hit? Crossbowman. Far can you go? Far can you go? Can you move up? Next turn. Take. Oh, are you serious? Gosh darn it. Okay, who's starving? Biblos is starving. Take out these guys while I can. They've got. They're in the water and they take more damage. I'm going to take a, make a castle here in Philadelphia. We might be able to get one out in time. If everyone's just dis distracted with here. That will give a huge combat strength to the city. Since this is the new war front. Of course Buenos Aires. During war on us. That's just how it rolls. They hate us for some reason. Okay. Um, take out riflemen. Can you hit? Nothing. What can you hit from here? And we'll kill off the... That crossbowman, you... Continue to build a road. As will you. You're gonna hang out in Philadelphia, wait for people to come around, and then blast the hell out of them. I really need to get the crossbowman in here so we can start taking care of Okay. We can really I think we can fend off most of these water attacks if we have the crossbowman in good places. Mountain range, really a huge godsend. Holy cow. We can take out these really strong units while they're in the water. That will be amazing for us. I do want Washington back though. Before I declare peace. Build a road. Build a road. So, so far we're doing a good job of getting these guys, pushing these guys back a little bit. I wonder if that will... How much that's gonna hurt. Oh yeah, we lost even more because we don't have the religion anymore. Here they come with more units. We can take it. You move him back a little bit. 
start picking them off with these crossbowmen. I think we can do it. I think we can. I think we can. Okay, so you got the road done here. That's really great. Thank you, sir. Got the road done there. And now we can move up here to start fixing this stuff. Okay, you move. Let me kill this off. Yep, that will free it up to get here. I would really have the Gatling gun by now, but I guess not. And kill off, or at least hurt him more. Move him up. I think they get, they get a major penalty by coming inland. Let's see what this is going to do if this will... Survive an attack from this. I'm not sure how much a cannon is going to hurt a cannon. Washington's defense isn't like necessarily amazing. Not like Moscow's was. Alright, well, we lost our one cannon. <laughs> That experiment didn't go the way I had hoped. Alright, so in closing of this episode, you can guys can see that um, what once was America is now turning into uh, Germandia. <laughs> and uh, what once was Russia is now America up in this Canadian area. And um, yeah, gosh, this is crazy. How in the world did we get up there all of a sudden? Oh, Moscow must have kicked in. Great, that's awesome for our science and everything. This was, fertilizer was 30 turns out, and now it's 6. So that's really helpful. Now, if only we can make peace with all these guys at some point. Can we trade with you guys? And maybe embassies? If we can, for some reason, you know, let bygones be got bygones and become friends with Russia, that would be really great. I don't know how the demographics look, but we're doing pretty crappy in pretty much everything. Still soldiers. Wow. All right. Well, thank you guys so much for watching. It means a lot to me. Please hit the like button and subscribe button. Leave comments. I'd love to hear what you guys' thoughts are. And I'll see you guys next time.